Today is the celebration of the MSC Isabella. MSC Isabella is our latest, largest ship in the world. It's 23,000 container-wise, and it's been named after Fabio Santucci's eldest daughter, Isabella. My name is Isabella Santucci. My dad is the president of MSC USA. We just couldn't believe this great honor was coming. I got emotional, my wife started crying, the kids were all excited, especially Isabella. We sincerely appreciate this, uh, this great honor from the Aponte family. Sitting here at the bow of this beautiful ship, we can now see why she's named after such a beautiful girl, Isabella. Despite our global growth, employing 37,000 people across the globe, we are still a family company. And I believe nothing shows this more than standing here today, celebrating a naming ceremony for Isabella and her family. It is a huge honor that MSC has selected the Port of Phoenix though for this ceremony and we could not have hoped for a more impressive ship. The ship MSC Isabella is not only a fleet of engineering but together with its sister ships is testament to both the success and the foresight of the Aponte family. We are gathered here today for a wonderful and historic celebration the naming of the latest vessel to be added to the MSC fleet, the MSC Isabella. Dear MSC Isabella, fair winds and following seas, may God bless the ship, its crew, and all its voyages to come. Thank you all. I joined the company in 1984 and the first vessel was only 400 TU, uh, six containers wide. Now we're looking at a ship 23,000 TU plus and 24 containers wide. Uh, these ships are 400 meters long and compared to the Francesca, she, she was 26 meters long. And I think it shows about our commitment not only to global trade but also to the UK in a big way. When we celebrate these moments in MSC's history, it's only right to do so surrounded by those who have contributed to our shared successes and who we hope will continue to share successes with us for many years to come. In the history of seafaring for a long time, the ships have always been prayed for before they go to sea because the sea is a fearsome place. And in the Christian faith, Jesus, most of his followers were fisher folk. And he had a particular way of calming the oceans and walking on water and we're asking for all those blessings to come for the ship, for the crew, and all who sail on her. I was very happy that the champagne smashed because now the ship will have good luck for its first voyage. A 12-year-old to be able to, to be, be godparent to a ship, wonderful, it's uh, exciting. And the memories of today uh, will last a lifetime. And I think actually the event, this is what MSC is all about. It's about passion, it's about family. It's about actually making things like this really personal because it is a personal company. This is not a job, this is a way of life.